Hello friends, welcome back to Vlogmas. In today's video, I'm about to hit up Dollar Tree. I was watching my friend Sarah Jane's video on her latest Dollar Tree finds. She had a couple things that I'm on the lookout for. It was a great video. I'll link it below if you missed it. My mom even made some Dollar Tree YouTube videos. So we are a long time Dollar Tree people. It is just a few days before Christmas, so I have no idea what's left in here. Let's go check it out. All right, y'all. So actually the store was not as picked over as I thought, but it was really crowded. So we are going to do an old fashioned car haul to show you guys what I got in store. I went in looking for the desk lamp. I'm sorry to report that I could not find one. I'm going to have to go to another Dollar Tree. But I also was looking for some Christmas bags, some gift boxes, and I'm also about to head out of town right after Christmas. So I do like to pick up some small travel things that I can just throw into my suitcase that are way, way cheaper at the dollar store. So first I did pick up these gift boxes. It looks like you're getting two of them. One does say season's greeting and green on the other side it does say merry christmas two dollars i also picked up some gift bags this one does say be merry in red and then i just got this green candy cane yo that is cute from the dollar store but they also had a ton of the jumbo bags still left this is huge i love the theme if you bought this at target or somewhere else you'd pay a lot more for it and it does say candy cane wishes gingerbread kisses also by the way if you are still looking they had quite a bit of gift wrap paper left i did need to pick up some tissue paper though so i went with this white with sparkles they had a bunch of different kinds though and this does include 20 sheets i feel like that's a pretty good deal and so then one aisle over on school supplies i did pick up a few things i recently did a target plan your year get your life together video that i will link below if you missed it but several items including a desk pad dollar tree hat so it's all very exciting all right and the first thing that i picked up was this set of six clips this is great for your planner your spirals um, i'm probably going to use this on my planner you're getting a set of six of them they come in different pastels and actually they are majorly giving me stony clover vibes and then i picked up a few spirals y'all that is such a trendy i'm gonna say it gen z pattern for a notebook so i did get this spiral and one of the things that i love about Dollar Tree notebooks. Wide rule, y'all. Every time, wide rule. So I picked up this one. I also got a solid pink one here, which actually this one is a little bigger, the solid pink one. The blue one here has 70 sheets and the pink one here has 100 sheets. So this one is a little bit bigger. And then I also got this kind of neutrally to green polka dot spiral, also 70 sheets. I feel like you can just never have too many spirals. I also picked up a couple binders, these one inch binders. They had them in other colors, including a neon pink a fun green but i did get them in this gray neutral they do also yes have pockets on the inside and then over there with all the notebooks they had this plastic tablet stand i honestly have no idea if this will work or it will be a fail but for one dollar i'm willing to risk it okay you guys this tablet holder 10 out of 10 so you can either use it this way and your tablet can be upright Feel like that's ideal for viewing or you can turn it around which i think this would be great if you kept it in your kitchen you are needing to look at a recipe book needing something flat y'all a dollar okay and speaking of a harder plastic i found this over in the pet section this is a dog bowl mat they also had this in a gray too i currently just use a place mat that's what my dog bowls are on so i'm willing to try it i think it looks nice too with this little tone on tone paw print and speaking of pets maybe not that exciting but i always get these at the dollar store it is the pet fresh odor eliminator where you just put this on your carpet you vacuum it up i think it smells great i have three dogs so i pretty much buy this in bulk and something else that i always buy at dollar tree is the blue dawn i had a makeup artist years and years ago tell me to not waste my money on more expensive brush cleaners just use a cup add a little bit of blue dawn and water and you are good to go to clean your makeup brushes also this size is really nice because i keep mine under my bathroom sink i don't really want to take up all this room with a large blue dawn and this will last me for a while and there was this whole display of different mopping and dusting items so i did pick up this pad that it says you can use it for both i'm personally just going to use it as a duster and then it attaches to this mop head here i think this is fantastic they can be so expensive 
expensive. I did also pick up the handle that does attach here. And then I did pick up two packs of these washcloths. They do have more of this knobby feel to them. My mom has been using these for years to wash her face. Because of the texture, you can really exfoliate and get in there. And it's nice that they're dark because then you don't have to worry about messing them up as you're taking your makeup, trying to cleanse for the day. I did get them in black. She uses them in gray. Like all black towels though, I would wash these separately first. And a couple of other finds over with Beauty, I did pick up this three-piece little hair set. They're calling these barrettes, but these are more like hair clips. You are getting a white one, kind of a tortoise and a cream, but these are really more just like bobby pin style. No, I think these are cute. They also did come in a metallic set as well, but I really liked the colors on this one. And I cannot believe Dollar Tree had the internet famous bubble candle. I've been seeing this all over Amazon. You can't even turn around without seeing the bubble candle. So I think that's awesome that they're here. They're saying that this one is a vanilla scent. I don't really mind what the scent is though. I have no intention of burning this one. I think they're too pretty. It did also come in a pink and blue, I believe. And another thing that I love to pick up at Dollar Tree is any travel sizes that I may need. It's a lot cheaper than if you run into Target and get a small shampoo or, or a small toothpaste. I also did pick up a fresh toothbrush. That I'm just going to keep in my travel pack in case I forget my toothbrush, someone else forgets their toothbrush, and then you're running around trying to find a Walgreens on your trip. A dollar. Another travel find that I always pick up is earplugs. This is a four pack. You're also getting the little carrying case. I keep one of these in every single suitcase that I have and in one of the side pockets because it's one of those items that you don't need it until you need it. And I've been buying rain ponchos from Dollar Tree for what seems like a hundred years. It's a must have whenever you travel. I can't even tell you how many Disney trips we've had to use these. I also like how thin they are because you can just throw them in the bottom of your handbag and the bottom of the backpack. They do say that this is reusable. I find that they're a little flimsy for that. So I think of these more as a one-time use, but if you end up at an amusement park or having to run into a store to buy ponchos, they are so much more expensive. You will be so glad that you just packed some Dollar Tree ones. And kind of random, but I also picked up these art palettes. I've recently tried doing DIY eyelash extensions. I will link the brand of the ones that I've been using. I quite like them, but as I'm doing them, I wanted something that I could get the glue on, um, that I could separate the eyelashes. So I think these little art palettes from Dollar Tree are going to work great. And you're getting six of these. And a couple of random finds. The first one is this Armor All. This is just their original formula. And Dollar Tree is the only place that I can find it in the smaller size. I like to just keep this in my car. And last up is this eyeglass cleaner. This is such a big container of this. I normally can only find small ones. This is over eight ounces. And if you are looking for this, a Dollar Tree was actually on top of all the sunglasses and readers. So just look up. But I'm constantly wearing blue light glasses for the computer. So really practical find. That does wrap up my Dollar Tree car edition haul. I would love to know what you guys pick up at Dollar Tree and I will see y'all tomorrow.